What are you doing? You got chocolate all over your face, bub. I might have to swap your seats, buddy, because uh, we got places to be. We got to go look at trucks. You ready? Yeah. And guys, do not forget, Wednesday, tomorrow, February 23rd is your last day to enter to win that truck plus five grand. And to those of you who are skeptical and always think that, man, the odds probably just aren't good enough. There's probably just way too many people that enter. There's no chance. There actually is a chance that you could be the owner and winner of that truck, but you have to get entered. There's not near as many people that enter to win those things as you would think. Is that not right, Reagan? I mean, people think, oh, you know, it's gotta be. I mean, it's gotta be like everybody that watches the videos and everybody that follows on Instagram. Nope, it's not the case. In fact, probably 99% of the people that follow us don't enter the giveaways each time because well, they think the same thing that everybody thinks. Not a good enough chance, so what's the point? Well, the opportunity is actually far greater than you believe, so take advantage of this and get entered because that truck has to go to somebody, could be you. Well, we are here in the Cadillac with the mother LNP. We're just gonna go with that for now. Anyways, we're here, we're gonna grab some lunch and then we're gonna hop over to a couple of dealerships and uh, check out some trucks. She doesn't want to go to full-blown, super cool mom, like diesel truck status, but she what? does want like a pickup truck. She's taking a pickup truck into consideration. I don't know if it's gonna be a diesel. I don't think she wants to go that route, but she does wanna she does wanna get a truck. So we'll go look at some options mm, and see what we find. It's very cushy. It has to have like a <laughs> super nice interior, coffee warming cup holders. <laughs> And um, they make warmers? Warmers. yeah, I was like, warmers, I, I said, warmers, everything warmers. yeah, I said, wouldn't like a heated cup holder be like a hazard? She's like, dude, we had the cigarette lighter things as kids and we would like take them and like burn stuff with them. I said, that's a major hazard. Why would you do that? She's like, oh, we use them all the time. Ask your viewers. I bet some of them use them to burn stuff when they had those in their vehicles. Yes, like those little plastic tags off of your new clothing items. You just melt them right off. <laughs> never, I've never even considered that, but if it works, it works. Catch you guys back out here in a minute. Okay, so lunch is done. It was amazing. We're on our way now to check out the Ram lot first. I showed my mother some Rams. I showed her some GMCs. What was your initial thoughts comparing that Ram to the GMC, which was the black one that I showed you? You said it looked kind of cheap. Yeah. The second one, which was which one? It was the GMC Sierra, 1500. kind of plasticky in the front, kind of, yeah, blah. The first one me, you showed me was like... It was a Longhorn 1500, <laughs> so we're actually gonna go check this thing out right now. We're like right around the corner from this lot, so we're gonna go check this thing out, but it was Delmonico Red, which Ooh, I know yeah, she likes. I liked that. And she likes red colored like vehicles in general. I there's do. obviously, there's so many different variants of red. There's bright red, there's like fire truck red, there's ruby red, cherry red, apple red. I kinda like all those. Rosine yeah, but red. yeah, rosine is kinda like its own kind of red, PR4 color, you know, you don't see a lot of them. Um, but we're gonna go check this one out and I think, I think she's gonna like it, so. Hopefully she gets hooked on the Ram idea. <laughs> We'll see how it goes though. Well, we'll see if we can convince pressure, her. Pressure, all this pressure. And let's see if we can track this buddy down. Oh, there's one right there. That's not the- What, that black one? Well, that's not the one that I showed you online, but that's also one that you should probably look at. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You definitely gotta okay, okay. Check, check this one out. Huh? I said, what do you think? Uh. Knuckles. Does it smell new? No. No? Not new. Oh yeah. It kind of smells like it might have been a smoker vehicle that they tried. It's a possibility it's a smoker truck. That they tried to clean up the scent. Trying to, no offense to smokers, but I don't like smoker trucks. Yeah. Not horrible, just like a... Just a faint one. But, oh man. Okay, I like this. Sunroof. I like the silver and black. I like the stick to It kind of matches your hair. Hey! hey. <laughs> you could just use it. I like the stitching. 
Oh, that is true. We do sell. The smoke smell out. We do sell interior oh, cleaning nice. products to get rid of scents. Could help. It really doesn't smell that strong. I don't know. No, it's not super strong, but I can smell but it. But let's go check out the Longhorn. That was option number one. We're still on option one, but that's a limited ram 1500 now we're gonna go see if they have that longhorn 1500 and if they do check that one out now it's probably gonna be down around the back that would be my guess okay so that's the longhorn right there is it yeah it is. yes it is that's the one eco diesel yeah <laughs> Okay, so this is nice too. It's brand new. Brand oh, new. This one's a brand new one? Well, 180 miles. Oh, oh yeah. Ooh. Mm, smell test check. Checks oh, it out. have a sunroof. That's only different. Oh, no sunroof. Oh, that's kind of weird too. Oh, dang it. I like the interior. I like that. I, like that. I, I like told it. her this matched her hair, the, the silver it's stitching. <laughs> It, look, look at all this, all the silver lining it's meant and. To be. I like the black leather. Yeah. Not gonna show any stains. That is nice. Black Smells leather. Really good. The stitching. <laughs> a purse holder. Yes. We'd be going from white seats to black seats. I know. That's nice. Secret compartments. <laughs> this is really nice. I like the black seats. Okay, we're gonna discuss this. This is serious. We also saw, we still looked at a maroon um, Longhorn. I was gonna film, but the guy had all of his stuff in there because a manager was driving it, and then a salesman came out and he was trying to get us to drive it and look at payment options and all kinds of stuff. It's probably what he was gonna do. So we're like, well, let's not do that today. We're gonna go to the Ford dealership, so you might wanna just like go out and then okay. write and then. Um, ah, that white go. one. And then we saw a white limited Ram 1500 with the Eco Diesel. So it was a limited Eco Diesel mm -hmm. and it was brand new. So the Ford lot's pretty empty, so we're gonna nix the whole Ford idea. Because <laughs> there's, there's, nothing. there's nothing here. There's a in truck. The truck lot. Yeah, there's one. There's one. There's one. But that's like the opposite of what she's looking for. She said not big lifted. That big was truck. cool looking. It's not that I don't like them, it's just what I'm gonna use it for driving it around. Okay, there might be one here for you to look at. It might be that white one over there. As long as it's for sale. I don't sale. like those blacked out wheels. Yeah. I have to have that changed. She is anti-blacked out wheels, just so you guys know. I like flash, flashy wheels. It's plated. It's got like a pirate thing on the back. Yeah, it's plated. So, Bummer. here's what's happening. I was all content with what I had. Oh no. <laughs> and, then, and then she saw Sorry, a John. And, and then, then she saw a limited Ram Eco Diesel. That white Eco Diesel it's with really that black boring. leather stitching with all the white stitching, I say what It's black like silver it's like black and silver white. interior. Maybe I'm partial to that. I don't know. It's pretty nice. Did it have a cigarette burner? <laughs> Mom, they don't do those anymore. I keep trying to tell her I'm that's not, not a really smoker. a thing anymore. I'm not, I'm not a, a smoker. Lighter. I'm not a smoker, but where's the useful things? Yeah, where are the useful <laughs> items like the <laughs> things to, to burn <laughs> off tags? You know, like those tags, like those plastic tags, you just can't, like labels, you just can't rip off of clothing items where you don't want to rip them because you rip this a thread. If you just melt burner. it real quick, then apparently you can just melt it and then it'll just pull right out. And it, yeah, don't tell me. You don't have viewers that didn't do that stuff. You guys let us know down in the comment section below. I'm I'm telling her I doubt very many people did that. I, I'm guessing she was just kind of an oddball, her and her siblings. But, no. No. you know, just, that's all I'm what? saying. I don't think no. it's as common as no. she's trying to make it sound. What? You know, so you guys let us know. Multi-use tool, multi-use function. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, because it's hard to get new vehicles, they're carrying a lot of like anything they can get their hands on. It's like there's a lot of Fords and Rams at the Chevy dealership. And then there was lots of used Dodge. There was more Mopar stuff than Ford stuff at the Ford dealership, like used stuff. So it's kind of weird looking for new cars now because there's a lot of everything you're not looking for on each of the lots. That's not the one, huh? No. Nope. What about it do you not like? Mm, I don't know. Just Everything? It's not calling me. 
well, it doesn't the call. Body style. It doesn't call a lot of people, I hear. I don't know. I just hate that body style. To me, the front ends are just kind of. I mean, if I had my ugly. ultimate pick, it would be what a uh, first gen. Oh, here we go. There is a high country up at the front to make sure that if you look at the high crunch, if you look at the high country, I want to say high crunchy, the high, <laughs> the high country, you have to talk to them because it's like right at the front doors. So that way they don't have to walk very far, you know what I mean? So where am I supposed to be stopping? I don't know, anywhere in here. They're all they're all pretty much the you same. You have a look whatever. Oh, the uh, white one. Yeah. yeah. That was nice. I liked that. What year was that one? 92. Okay, no, there's a 70 something I really like. You're probably, uh, you've got to be thinking of like the late 70s power wagons. Maybe that's what it is. Guys, don't hate us yet. I know it's Nissan, but hear me out. Cummins Diesel, Nissan Titan. Okay, but compared to the Chevys. Sadly, it kind of looks better than them. I mean, guys, compared to the new Chevys, it's a lot better. Ford Raptor. And then these ones. That's a, I mean, that's a real truck too. Let me cool look stuff. inside. I don't think I've ever looked inside. They're pretty one. cool. I don't know if it's um, locked or not. Well, the Toyota dealership doesn't have any Toyota trucks, but they do have a Ford F-150 Roush package. What do you know? Do do you, I don't, <laughs> it's cool. It's just cool. Okay, so essentially the Roush package, I don't know all the details, all I know is it's supposed to be like a super high performance V8 model of that truck. Lots of horse torques and all that other good stuff. Okay, mom, so out of the trucks you saw. Out of the trucks I saw. There was the white, Limited Ram Eco Diesel, the one that you said you like the black interior, the silver lining, that, stitching, and all that. Uh, that was nice. Probably, probably one of my favorites. I like the Longhorn, even though we didn't get to show you guys because the manager's like, oh, I'm actually driving that. I got guns in there and wallets and all <laughs> yes, kinds of did. stuff. And he like clicked the beeper and locked it up. <laughs> After I already opened the doors After we and like looked. saw what credit cards he had. And... Yeah, he's like, I've got all kinds of stuff in there if you look hard enough. <laughs> Anyways, that one was nice. Couldn't show you though, because there was a lot going on right there. Then we went to the Ford lot. There wasn't really anything there. Nothing. We saw a Ford Raptor on a Nissan lot. Which oh, looked oh. kind of like a teenage car, no offense. Truck, she's sorry. like, she's like, this is like a truck you'd like get it, get with your friends and go down to Florida or something. <laughs> it was like a, it was like an electric blue Ford Raptor. And then um, we went to the Toyota lot, Toyota. and there like was Roush. there was a Roush F one fifty, but like no Toyota trucks. And then we stopped by a Chevy dealer, and she pretty much was like, I don't like any of these. These are all like not so, my style. My favorite I was the it. white. Eco diesel. I knew it was black be there, leather yeah. interior, silvery gray stitching, roomy. The seats looked really roomy. The back seats back seat looked really roomy. It was big. One drawback that one didn't have a sunroof, and I do like those. That's but true. I could get over that. That was a nice one. You guys let us know down in the comment section below which one you think would suit her better since you know all of her needs with well, a vehicle. You know, and I was so you know what was funny? We were pulling out of the Listen. Chevy dealership and there was like a smart car <laughs> plugged in. It was like a battery powered smart car <laughs> plugged in, and she's like, in all honesty, <laughs> that would work just fine. I mean that's technically all I need. It's usually me in the car by myself unless I get to have this little smoochy baby in with me. What matches my personality is more that white one. That white one. Oh, cute baby. That white one with the, see, this is why we need a roomy vehicle. <laughs> right. And Grandpa LNP would like that white one. He would. He, he would. would. He'd probably have you driving his truck and be like, how about I just drive that to work? <laughs> well, guys, let us know down in the comment section below which one do you think would be the baby. better pick. We didn't have a lot of Fords to look at, unfortunately, nice to really holder. compare. Uh -huh. <laughs> Did we check but, out the cup holders? Um, we didn't. We didn't. I don't know if they'll meet the cup holder, heated cup holder test. But anyways, guys, let us know down in the comment section below. Don't forget to enter to win that blue 24 valve second gen plus the five grand because that giveaway does end tomorrow, February 23rd at 11.59 p.m. Then that giveaway is gone. We have all new coffee products, detailing products, 
handmade products like this money cuff I've got on right now. And the which, coffee is bomb. It is bomb. <laughs> and the coffee ships blazing fast. Like a lot of the people that have been ordering it have been getting yeah, it in like right two away. days. Well, your uncle got it in Texas. Like yeah, in, within 48 days. hours. Yeah, a couple of It was after ordered and then to his house within 48 hours. And that coffee is roasted the day that it ships out. It's not like stocked on shelves mm -hmm. for months and then they're like, oh, here's a bag. We'll send that out to you. No, this coffee is roasted the day that it ships and it is the fresh and best tasting coffee you're gonna get okay but go try it for yourself and if you like it enough get on our weekly or bi-weekly or monthly coffee right. subscription right and it'll automatically get shipped you to your do door. not want to run out of coffee no and it'll saying? automatically get shipped to your door you don't even have to think about it and right now every single order from the US $15 or more gets free shipping okay that's no discount no that's yeah. a good deal no yeah no discount that's code cool. required all orders $15 plus you get free shipping right now and you get 30 times entries guys there's a lot of good going on here a lot of perks <laughs> and if you guys want to get entered to win it's your last chance lots of items but items will sell out so Anyways. He likes the Cadillac. Anyways. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next video. Peace.